Well, this is the Bruin Lake Campground at the Pitney State Park Recreation Area in southeastern Lower Michigan. Now, I stayed at the Pitney Campground years and years ago, but I don't recognize any of this, and I believe they've moved the campground from one lake to another. Now, this is Bruin Lake itself, maybe 300 square feet in size, and not a whole lot of houses around it. It's mostly just a park and a couple houses and the rest of the wooded area. Uh, there's a swimming beach over here as well as a boat launch and then uh, the frontage along the lake with a fishing dock here. The campground by state park standards is really quite nice. This seems to be an add-on though and many of these sites have uh, asphalt landing pads to park in whereas if you go up the hill here in the wooded area, the sites are a little bit older. Uh, but even though these sites are nice, clean, and new looking, they're still State Park Fair where you have uh, electricity only, no water, and no sewer hookup. But still, all in all, very nice. Uh, small park though, 139 sites, I think, is all it is. Here's a typical campsite, this one being vacant. I believe though this may be handicapped because it does have a uh, asphalt around the uh, fire pit. But there's a asphalt landing pad for the RV and a spot for an extra car there. Now our campsite, which is the next one over, you can see the distance between the campsites is almost identical to this except there is no asphalt around the fire pit. That's what leads me to believe this is a handicapped spot. Well, this is kind of interesting. All of the picnic tables at the state park, or at least in this area of the state park, they're all handicap accessible, uh, wheelchair accessible, I should say. Well, this is a beach area, believe it or not. Not really a sandy beach per se, although it's fairly sandy in the water, but there is no sand up here. Now, we're really not all that far actually from Detroit. Um, Detroit's maybe the Detroit area is maybe 50 miles east of here. So there's a lot of aircraft traffic in the day uh, just starting to uh, come down in altitude, you know, for landing in the Detroit area. So it can be a little noisy at times, but not too bad. This is part of the Waterloo Recreation Area, which includes this lake, um, actually about 30 miles worth of trails and several lakes and uh, you, there's plenty of biking and hiking trails and uh, you can actually stay at certain areas designated just for hikers campsites so you could hike uh, from one end of the park to the other actually at about 30 miles or so so you know there's no one huge thing to do but a little bit of something for everybody i suppose now we're still early in the camping season for Michigan. We're still in the very first week of June during the week and there's not a whole lot of campers here. But it tends to get full during the weekends and of course during the summer it can be very difficult to get in because there's only 139 sites here. So I recommend reservations like in any state park. Now this is our campsite number 97 and you can see we've got this huge area to ourselves here and with an unspoiled view of the lake basically and then there's a hiking path to the right of our site 